Hi everyone, my name is Taj Walker, and today I'm here with Stan Faulkner of Faulkner Law, and today we're going to talk to him a little bit about his experience, his background, and what goes on here at Faulkner Law Firm. We're going to speak a little bit about the probate process, state planning, and what goes on here with him. So thank you so much, Stan, for having us and sharing the information with us. I appreciate you having me. Thanks for the invite. Yeah. You got it, Stan. So Stan, can you tell me a little bit about your experience and what goes on here at your law firm? Sure. Well, um, I got my first license in 2001. Um, then licensed in Missouri in 2002, Connecticut 2008, and then here in Georgia after. Mm -hmm. All those experiences have done a lot of different things. So I've been around the block and have had been um, uh, gained a lot of experience in different types of cases. But here at Faulkner Law, we do really primary three things. We do probate and estate planning, and those kind of go together. We do a lot of work with small businesses, mm -hmm. counseling them or helping them with any kind of disputes. Mm -hmm. Then we also do real estate for folks. Awesome. So probate. Mm -hmm. What is probate and what specifically does a probate attorney help a client do? Good question, right? Um, probate is a process that means proving. And essentially what we're trying to do is either prove somebody's will or prove the heirs of the decedent, right? The person that passed away. And that process takes some time to get through. And what the, the attorney's job in that function is to help them either learn that the document's valid or not. It's either also to help settle any kind of disputes with family members that may, and you'd be surprised, a lot of them, there's lots of issues out there. But we're trying to be the person that helps push them through that process and educate them about what to do and when to do it. Awesome. So I know probate is not folks' initial plan. So what should folks, I guess, expect when they go to the courthouse? Mm -hmm. And then how, how, how can folks also avoid the probate process? What can they do to be proactive versus reactive? And I know that may tie in also to the third thing you do, one of the things you do, which is estate planning. Yeah, very good question, because I think you, you're right in that you, sometimes you want to avoid it because of the process, right? And I tell folks, if you're going through probate and if you're going to try to do it on your own, you should know it's a process. So if you go to the courthouse the first time expecting, here's dad's will, they'll take it, but they're not gonna take it, right? And it's gonna take you some time to get through that. And essentially it means that you gotta file a petition. And, and that whole, just doing that can be hard, but then it's gonna take a month at least for the court to accept it and then go through it. And so what we try to educate folks on is sometimes you wanna avoid that. And if you're avoiding it, then you're doing the estate planning process. And essentially what that means is we are taking a look at everything that you have in your life. And it doesn't matter if it's only a house um, or if it's multiple. What we're trying to do is create a plan around that that helps us avoid the courthouse as much as we can, right? And we're essentially establishing what your legacy is and, and creating a, a, a plan that allows you to take care of it and pass it on to the next generation or whomever you want but trying to be all encompassing when we do that. Sure, sure. So this is great. I know a lot of folks have questions about the probate process, what to do within it, and the estate planning process. So thank you so much for sharing. This has been My awesome. Pleasure. So if you have any questions regarding probate, estate planning, or real estate, uh, please give Stan a call. He's very good at what he does. So thank you all for watching this episode of Cobb County Community Connections, and I will see you all in the next one.